I call this demo lights out. And um, I did a Google search on lights out and came up with that image. And I love that. I think it's like a bullet being shot, you know, with one of those strobe photographs and the tungsten filament burning out. I, maybe it's staged, but I just think that's great. It has nothing to do with the demonstration I'm going to show you here, but it's still cool. Yeah, we want the lights on for this one. Okay? So I'm very carefully measuring out some solution A and equally careful with my measuring out of solution B. And I'm going to use that cooler top just as a little backdrop here. Um, that'll work. Good. So what happens when you mix A and B? Any, because this is, you might not see it against here or the dark background, so let's find out. You can make your predictions, but da 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 ba -da. Huh. Uh-oh. Did I pour A into B or B into A? I don't remember. I never, I never get this right. <laughs> now, a lot of you had looked away. Yeah, this one's not working, huh? Talking to your neighbor there. So I'll do it one more time. And this time, I'm going to keep pouring. And you guys, you guys know this. When you show this to a general audience, whatever, it's like this is the most amazing thing ever. <laughs> and, and, and to be honest, it is. But it's the iodine clock reaction, and I'm just a big fan of this one. I'm going to pour it this time once, twice. <clears throat> yeah, I make it three times. And I'm just going to keep pouring here. What's going to happen now? Hmm. <laughs> of course. So I'm not going to go into any detail on that, but it's just a good one thinking. So, Show that to their students, and the question is to have them just write. Just have them write about what they think is going on. What are the molecules doing? They're kind of like hanging out like this. We react? No, no, we're not supposed to react yet. Yet? No, no, not yet. Have them come up with a feasible explanation for what's going on there. See what they come up with. I know you might want to do it as some kind of connection experiment, but just you can do this on day one of your class and just say, what, what are they doing in there? They have no brains, and yet, how did that happen? Okay? So, well, but the lessons, see, I was being patient there, wasn't I? And you know this is the case. Patience is everything. Okay? You know, think back to your favorite teachers back when you were in elementary or middle school, high school. I bet without exception in this room, everyone's favorite teacher was probably also the most patient teacher. Okay? If I have ever made any valuable discoveries, it has been owing more to patient attention than to any other talent. And look who said that. A man who had quite a few talents, but it was his patience that he put to the top of the list. Okay?